And now some fireworks for a FireWire vulnerability in the Linux kernel. So as background, Linux input output control codes or ioctals serve as an interface between user space and kernel space. And in the Linux kernel, there is an optional module that exposes an ioctal for controlling a FireWire digital TV, FDTV in the code we're gonna look at. So if this interface is present in the kernel, like I said, it's an optional thing, an attacker can send in ACID messages from user space that will subsequently be parsed by the kernel driver. So I'm going to provide you a bunch of code on the website, but first I just want to kind of talk you through how the control flow reaches where the vulnerability is. So we've got a call stack starting from the FDTV CAI octal that is here taking in attacker controlled commands and arguments. And we're gonna say, okay, let's assume that this command ultimately hits this switch case for the CA send message, which leads to FDTV CA send message. And it passes in that attacker controlled argument. That attacker controlled argument subsequently gets placed in a message, blah, blah, blah. And we're gonna say that this, you know, hits this case right here and is gonna call FDTV CA PMT. So again, we're ioctal to send message to CA PMT. All right, so this and the following function are the ones that I want you to actually analyze. So we've got attacker controlled input here, and ultimately I'm gonna say that it's going to call into this AVC CA PMT, as it indicates right here. And what is the net result and where is the vulnerability? Well, go ahead and check it out on the website and see if you can find the flaw.